Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation? Solution from here. And what we have here, this follows. What we have a raised to power m minus n. This same thing as a raised to power m over a raised to power n. But this here we have a raised to power x over a raised to power 1 equals to 40 from here. That is, here we can write this as 8 raised to the power x over 8 raised to the power 1, that's 8. Then equals to, we can write this as 40 over 1. The next step here, cross multiply. 8 raised to the power x times 1, same thing as 8 raised to the power x. Then equals to 40 times 8 on this side. That is, here. We take the log on both sides. Here we have log 8 raised to the power x equals to log 40 times 8 on this side. Then here we apply the power of log ring. When we have log m raised to the power p, this same thing as p log m. At this here we have x log 8 equals to log 14 times 8 here. The next step here, we divide both sides by log 8. That is, divide this side by log 8. Also, divide this side by log 8, which implies log 8 cancel each other here. We have x equals to log 40 times 8 over log 8. Then, yeah, this follows. When we have log a times b, we can write this as log a plus log b. Now this here we have x equals to log 40 plus log h over log h then here we separate this into two fractions now we have x equals to log 40 over log h plus log h over log h that is here, log h cancel each other. We have one left, which implies x equals to log 40 over log h plus 1. Then, also here, you can write 40 as 8 times 5. Then, all we have here becomes x equals to log. 8 times 5 over log 8 plus 1. That is, this also follows the law of log ring, and we have x equals to log 8 plus log 5 over log 8 plus 1. Also, separate this into two. Fractions we have x equals to log 8 over log 8 plus log 5 over log 8 plus 1. Then here log 8 can switch other. We have one less, which implies x equals to 1 plus 1. That's 2 and plus log. 5 over log 8. Then, next step here, we can express it as 2 times 2 times 2, that's 2 cube. Then, here we have x equals to 2 plus log 5 over log 2 cube. Then, we apply the power of log here. 3 comes here, and we have x equals to 2 plus log 5 over 3 log 2. 
which also can be written as x equals to 2 plus 1 over 3 times log 5 over log 2. Then we apply change of base a. When we have log a over log b, I express this as log a to base b. That is, we have x equals to 2 plus 1 over 3 log 5 base 2. Then we bring this together as one fraction, this 2 over 1. And we have x equals to the same here, we have 3. Then here, this becomes 6 plus. Here we have log 5 base 2. That is the value of x here we have. S equals to 6 plus log 5 base 2 all over 3. Then let's check here if this satisfies this given problem. At this, we substitute the value of x here, which is x equals to 6 plus log 5 base 2. All over 3. And this is all we have here becomes 8 raised to power 6 plus log 5 base 2 all over 3 minus 1. Is it equals to 40 on this side? That is here. Yeah. We bring this together as one fraction. This 1 over 1. And we have 8 raised to power. Let's see, made as 3. Here we have 6 plus log 5 is 2 then minus 3 here this is equal to 40 on this side then here we have 6 minus 3 that's 3 this becomes 8 raised to the power 3 plus log 5 is 2 all over 3 this is equal to 40 on this side then we can express it here as 2 raised to the power 3 which is raised to power 3 plus log 5 is 2 all over 3. Is it equals to 40 on this side? And this power multiplies 3 here cancel each other. We have 2 raised to power 3 plus log 5 is 2. Is it equals to 40 from here? Then this follows when we have a raised to power n plus n. This same thing as a raised to power n and z raised to power n. This here, we have 2 raised to power 3 times 2 raised to power log 5 base 2. Is this equals to 40 on this side? 2 raised to power 3 here, that's 8 times. This follows when we have a raised to power log b base a, which is equals to b. This here we have 5. Is it equals to 40 on this side? And 8 times 5 here gives us 40. This is equals to 40 here. We have left hand side equals to the right hand side. Then we conclude that x equals to 6 plus log 5 is 2 all over 3 satisfy this given problem and thank you for watching don't forget these steps subscribe for more videos and turn the notification bell on share this video give it a thumbs up and put your comments see you next class and bye for now